find the HCF of 36, 40 and 56. To find the HCF, first we should do the prime factorization of each number separately. That is C. 36, 40, 56. Okay, next. Here for this number, last digit is 6, even so we take 2 here. First number is 3. A number close to 3 in 2 table is 2 once 2. 3 minus 2 is 1, 1 carried forward making it 16. When do we get 16 in 2 table? 2, 8, 16. Now here we have 18, 18 is 2 nines. 9 is 3 threes. Now 3 is a prime number so we take 3 once 3. Now for this number last digit is 0 so we take 5 here. First number is 4 smaller than 5 so we take 2 numbers that is 40. When do we get 40 in 5 table? 5 8s 40. Now here we have 8. 8 is 2 fours 8. Now 4 is 2 twos 4. Now 2 is a prime number so we take 2 ones 2. Now for this number last digit is 6 even so we take 2 here. First number is 5. A number close to 5 in 2 table is 2 twos 4. 5 minus 4 is 1, 1 carried forward making it 16. When do we get 16 in 2 table? 2, 8, 16. Now for this number last digit is 8 even so we take 2 here. First number is 2. When do we get 2 in 2 table? 2, 1, 2. Next number is 8. When do we get 8 in 2 table? 2, 4, 8. Now here we have 14. 14 is 2, 7, 14. Now 7 is a prime number so we take 7 once 7. So now our HCF is HCF is the product of numbers that are present here and here and also here. So now we should find the numbers that are present in these three places. I repeat, we should find the numbers that are present here and here and also here. So let us find. Starting with the number 2. Do we have 2 here? Yes. So next place, do we have 2 here? Yes. So now you cut 2 and write here. Now next number is 2. Do we have 2 here? Yes. So next place, do we have 2 here? Yes. So you cut 2 and write here. Next number is 3. Do we have 3 here? No. So no need to check in the other place. Next number is 3. Do we have 3 here? No. So no need to check in the other place. No more numbers are left. So now you multiply these numbers. Whatever number you get, that is your HCF. That is 2 into 2, 4. So this is our HCF. Am I clear?